So Wilde graduated from Oxford and uh, fell into unemployment. He kicked around London for a little while, but really couldn't find any stable um, source of income. He tried his hand at writing poetry, he published a book of poems, um, and he uh, became friends with the celebrities of the day. And one of those was Lily Langtree, who was one of the beauties of the day. Another was the painter James McNeil Whistler. And because he was friends with these people, he attracted the attention of a caricaturist in Punch magazine. And that eventually attracted the attention of a theatre promoter called Richard Doyley Cart. And it was Doyley Cart who offered Wilde the opportunity to go to the US. Um, to go to the US and to advertise a musical that was then the great sensation of the day, a musical called Patience or Bunthrone's Bride. But this was a bit of a pact with the devil Wilde had made uh, because the, the musical was actually making fun of Wilde and making fun of aesthetes and people who cared about art, people like Oscar Wilde. So Wilde took up this offer essentially because he was unemployed and he had nothing else to do really, um, but he had made a pact with the devil.